This is Greiner Walks. My name is Stefan and I'm interviewing colleagues from around the world. Today we're going to start with Monique. I'm going to meet her in Linz. We're going to talk about life. We're going to talk about building a family, starting a job and what makes her move. This is the school I attended seven years. Did you say like quickly hello? I don't think so. <laughs> no, why not? I mean, if you think about something that you will always remember from this school, what would that be? Meeting my best friend. Okay. I met her here and we've been best friends since. You brought a friend, huh? Yeah, Another my one. friend. You want to like introduce That's Chili. that young lady? She's six years old. I would say she's my second best friend. Your second best friend? Yeah, she's yes. my soulmate, kind of. Great. So how do you get from here to, to Greiner? I got pregnant Okay. in my 17th. And when I turned 18, I went on maternity leave for two years. And after that, I had to earn some money because children cost a lot of it, as it turns out. How does it work? Dog, mother? Working, that's like a lot of different roles. My family is a big, big help and without them this wouldn't even be possible. All right. Still sure we won't go in and, and say pretty hello to sure. your teacher? Yeah, pretty sure we won't All do right. that. <laughs> Does this feel like home? No, <laughs> not home, but I, I spend a lot of time here. It's just not the home feeling I get. I never defined home to be a place. It's just the feeling I get when I am surrounded by people I love or that love me. So you've come a long way, originally from Australia. Yeah. You need to explain that. Well, my mother is Austrian and my father was American. And they met in Australia. So, so you were little when you moved yeah. from Australia to Austria? Yeah, I was nine months. It's actually quite funny because a lot of people mix Australia and Austria. Yeah. Isn't it? <laughs> That's true. And would you speak German and English, German or English at home? I was raised um, speaking English. My father always spoke English with us and my mother always spoke German. And, and, and among the siblings, what was the language? English until my father died. And then somehow we switched to German because everywhere else you speak German. And so that kind of just happened. I think it's time for a coffee or tea. Yes. Coffee or tea? Coffee. coffee, 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 coffee. Me as well. So let's go get into the warm cafe. Yeah. Yeah? All right. The dog is guiding us. You keep yourself busy. It seems like your day is longer than mine. Yeah, I mean, it is you do a lot of stuff. Long. I mean, like, <laughs> very, very full of energy. Long. Coffee person. How many cups a day? I would say four or five. <laughs> four or five? Something you don't want to give up? No, definitely not. Looking at what you do at Greiner, can you just quickly describe what you do? I am an apprentice mm -hmm. and I'm in the like maintenance department. Yeah. And basically if a machine has a problem or is broken, we go and fix it. And I, as a mechatronics, I learn to fix it electrically and um, mechanically. And how did, how did you get to that decision? I mean, a young woman, that's an unlikely uh, career move. My mom works at Greina. Like I, I grew up with Greina. It's like my second home. She never worked somewhere else. So for your family, Greina is really a family business. Yeah, Greina is kind of part of our family. You want to share a dream? What, what's, a, what's a dream in life? Is there something special with you? Like I always wanted to do. Like... Yeah, I want to visit many countries. New Zealand, Australia. I would like to just live there. America, Canada, Alaska. But that's a lot of like cold places. Yeah, I know, that's so weird. But you were saying before like you're like <laughs> yeah. a, a freezy person. No, Australia is warm. So there is a lot of countries to go to, it seems. Mm -hmm. Tell me about your first day at Greiner. What do you remember? I was so nervous. <laughs> I remember I, I couldn't sleep the night before. I, in the morning I would get up like an hour before I had to leave just to make sure I have everything I need. And yeah, it was stressful. 
and then turned out to be different or were you stressed throughout the day? No, I got to know everybody and then it was fine. Like everybody was really nice. A lot of guys. <laughs> a lot of guys. How is that like working with a lot of guys? I can like get along with everybody. I never have problems with people. So one question is what makes you get up in the morning? What makes you move? As soon as I'm up, it's like I like going to work and I really enjoy being there and being with the people there and just um, talking with them. I, I figure that if you have like good relationships and work, you always like to go more. So if you had one message to the world, what would that message be? Friendliness never costs anything. Like if you're friendly to everybody, it doesn't cost you anything. So true. Thank you so much for being with me here today. You're welcome. Thank Very you much also. enjoyed this. Me too.